What is API versioning? It's the question of how you can keep changing and improving your APIs without disrupting existing API consumers. In today's video, we look at the two major strategies for how to manage API versioning. APIs, or Application Programming Interfaces, allow two applications to communicate. For this reason, APIs are widely used in today's network economy, but this also creates a problem. A consuming application makes assumptions about how the API behaves. There's a form of contract between them. Now let's assume the API provider wants to improve their API to make it more attractive for potential new consumers. When they update their API, how does that affect existing consumers? There are two possibilities. The first and preferable way to deal with this is that an API can be updated without disrupting existing consumers. That way, the API provider can keep improving their product while API consumers don't have to do anything unless they want to take advantage of newly added capabilities. The beauty of this model is that it balances the needs of providers and consumers. The challenge is that this kind of extensibility needs to be designed into an API from the very start. Because this design looks forward into the future, it is called forward compatibility. It's not a very hard thing to do, but the biggest challenge is to think of it ahead of time. But it's worth it, because if you don't do it, you'll end up with a second way of handling API versioning. That second way is to publish separate versions but then the question is how to provide both versions in parallel and how to migrate users of older versions to newer versions. This can be done if there are mechanisms in place how to mark versions as deprecated and mechanisms how to communicate this to existing consumers. If this is planned from the very beginning as part of API design and documentation, this is relatively easy, but it needs to be part of the API lifecycle management from the very start. If there is such a plan in place, then using semantic versioning as a way to use speaking version numbers is a good idea and a widely adopted practice. In summary, API versioning should be planned from the very beginning. Try to avoid breaking changes by designing APIs for extensibility. Simply put, extensibility means to not take away things that you have promised and to not add things in unexpected locations but also think about how to design and document your API so that you can communicate information about API versions. That way you can inform consumers about incremental improvements, but you can also alert them when you are publishing an API version that is not backwards compatible.